This movie will show you how to register a domain name through your control panel. There are three simple steps you need to follow. Log into your control panel, navigate to the domain manager section, and then register your preferred domain. The first step is to log into your web hosting control panel. You can do that through the control panel login link in the top right corner of the page. Now fill in your login details. This will be your username and password in the corresponding members area login form. Now press the login button to go straight to your control panel. The control panel step has been completed successfully. Now let's proceed to the second step, opening the domain manager. Once in the control panel, click on the Domain Manager icon in the Site Management section. Now you only have one step left, to register your own domain name. Once in the Domain Manager, click on the Register Transfer tab to go straight to the Domain Registration Wizard. Now enter the domain you wish to register in the Enter a Domain Name blank field. To get a specific result for the TLD domain extension, use the checkboxes or get more complex results by clicking the Check All link. You can check the multi-year pricing for all offered TLDs in the right hand table. Now click on the Search Now button to see the domains that are available for registration or transfer. Here are all the results relevant to your TLD request. Go through the options and choose the one that suits you best. To register a domain name, mark the green register option on its right. If you wish to register more than one domain name at a time, then simply mark their corresponding register checkboxes. To confirm your final domain selection, click on the Purchase Selected button. This will take you to the domain Whois page, where you need to confirm your Whois details. For your convenience, the default Whois details match your hosting account information. If you need to edit them, simply specify the new details in the available fields. The Whois information is divided into four basic sections. Registration, Administrative, Billing and Technical. You can use the checkbox option under each Whois section to copy the information from one section to another automatically. As soon as you are ready with the Whois details, you will need to agree with our terms and conditions of the service. Your Whois information is publicly visible by default and you can hide it from the public eye by clicking the red link. Now select the preferred method of payment, credit card or PayPal. Click on Next to go to the Billing Information page. If you have selected a credit card payment option, you will need to supply the standard billing details. First, choose your credit card type. Then enter the credit card number. the expiration date and the security code. Next we come to the card holder details section. For your convenience we have set the default details to be the same as your hosting account information. As soon as you are ready with the billing details, submit by clicking the submit payment link to purchase the selected domain name. That's it. 
Now you know how to register your own domain name in a few quick and easy steps.